Good evening, I'm Sherry and I'm one of Nine Girls Resident Dancers. The moment we can parked in Queen's Road Car Park, this will be usually parked when we do our evening gigs on a Saturday. But if you're feeling really posh, you can park in the Oracle Car Park. One of Mangal's resident belly dancers. And this is Helen, <laughs> another one of Mangal's belly dancers. And we're just arriving for work tonight. So, this is Mangal Turkish restaurant. One of the first things we do when we go in is we quickly check out the layout, see where the furniture is being positioned, and then we also check out where our clients are seated so we know which dance floor areas we're working in. So, come on, we're gonna go. come along with us, follow us. Lots and lots of safety pins as well. I always have mine on my makeup bag because then you can't possibly use them. And the other thing that we always have that we need plenty of water because dancing for half an hour, you get very hot and very thirsty. And the first thing you want when you come back up is a nice glass of water. <laughs> okay, come on through. We're just heading into the Liddies. <laughs> In the, the next thing we do is we take out the motion of business cards and we pick them up for people that are interested in learning about the dance with myself and or Rachel. Um, they can also book us for corporate events, hen parties, weddings, all sorts. We do it all. Okay, so in these ladies' loops, you girls, performers of the Casper Cabaret, will be able to change. Get into costume, make sure you're safely in and pinned where needed, and of course, you get to enjoy rather large mirrors to sort out your makeup, get everything ready, and then you can go downstairs already kitted out to the floor. <laughs> Ooh, look, we're in Turkey! Not really. <laughs> <laughs> is, my, is the light on? Yeah. Excellent. Yeah, okay. It's on. Okay. So Hi. Here we are. Hi, Helen. Hello. Hello. Um, which I'm just about to go down, do the first set. So um, very important. Don't let your costume drag on the floor. Yes. Health okay. and safety. We love a bit of health and um, safety. You never know who you're going to meet on the stairs. So sometimes an idea just to protect your modesty a little bit to begin with. Yes. You can use. Oh, slow down, Helen. I'm trying to negotiate stairs and holding a video camera. Oh dear, <laughs> health and safety. Well done. Oh dear. And I'm in heels. Um, yes, we sometimes use veils and wrap it around ourselves as a form of cover-up. Some of us actually wear full cover-ups. Some of you know, uh, it's Rachel speaking by the way, that I wear in a buyer sometimes when I'm backstage. Whatever is convenient for you, but a cheap and cheerful cover-up is, is to use a veil. So this is backstage. I'm still getting down the stairs, hold on. This is the door, so really, it's now a question of um, waiting um, until the staff are ready to put the music on. I let them know that I'm ready. Mm. And I can see already, I'm just, you kind of assess where people are in the restaurant. If you're dancing at Casbah Cabaret, you'll know that you'll be going over to the right hand side because that's our VIP area where it will only be Casbah Cabaret um, uh, spectators and students there. So you're not going to have to worry about covering the whole restaurant. No, it's not open. Go on in a second, but just to let you know, so you're going to go around to the right. I, however, can see that most of the clients this evening are towards the front. There's a few around the back as well, but I know that I need to go and make my big entrance towards the front. 
We can hear so, we can hear the music yeah. as well. We try to monitor the music. You have to try and listen to what's going on. Sometimes you can't always hear when your tracks come on. You have to hope that they're going to turn it up. But sometimes you, you have to listen for a while. And uh, we always start off stage. So that's the good thing. You pick tunes that have um, a nice introduction so the audience gets going. Such as this one. And there we go. I can now hear my music. So I'm going to go. Go for it. Bye. Bye. <laughs> But good crowd, good audience, really fun, some really cute kids there as well, which is always nice. So I'm going to go um, up and get changed, and um, then it'll be time for set two. Not <laughs> 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 tripping over my skirt as I go. Health and safety. You're on now. I am filming you. <laughs> I'm just letting the girls know. Okay, so. You stretch, you warm up, you can carry on doing so here when you're backstage before you hear your name announced. Have you know that, that as demonstrated by Natasha, um, I've already warmed up and stretched, so I'm good to go, but I'm keeping emotion going just to keep that sustained. I don't know if you noticed before with Helen, but we take responsibility for our own door opening. We get ourselves out. All we, yourself, do yeah. everything yourself. You can't rely on everybody here in the restaurant is so busy looking after the customers really oh, yeah. nobody's worrying about the dancers the dancers look after themselves and then you have to go out there and look after the customers too so um the glamour ends with the costume <laughs> a, the rest of it is all of, us it's all oh are you on not yet no not just yet is this it? this really is exactly how it is i know my music is imminent i can see them with the laptop i've, I've thumbed thumbed up a few times and the thing is, if something happens out there, you could be warmed up and ready to go, but if a big group comes in just before you're going to dance, you're not going to be dancing until they're all fully settled down. Exactly. So you can be standing out in a cold corridor for another 10 minutes. And that means you've got to stay warm. Oh, there's Here the they music. Go. Are you ready? Yeah, we'll just go out on the arms. See you later. So we're lucky enough to have a member of staff from Mangal here. Could you introduce yourself, please, sir? Hi, I'm Gerson Domenning. And what do you do? <laughs> Assistant manager. Assistant manager, woohoo! Sounds good. And um, what's it like um, having belly dancers in the restaurant? What, what happens? What, what, what is the difference having well, belly dancers? It's really nice because it obviously builds a really nice atmosphere and it draws customers in because they like to see the belly dancers. and. They're good as well, so it's great all round entertainment. And <laughs> oh, they're good, are they? All right. They're, they're okay. <laughs> they're <laughs> no, right. And they're really good, and they obviously build a nice atmosphere, and we get a lot of regulars just to see them again, so it's definitely a good thing for a restaurant to do. Oh, there we go. You heard it from the horse's mouth, and that is the truth. And uh, so there you go. It's a very important work we're doing here. So um, that's all we're going to do. Okay. Thank you for being on camera. I'll no switch you off now. Thank you. <laughs> Okay, I think uh, Rachel is on her way out. I don't know if you could Hello! <laughs> I don't know if God knows what my makeup's doing right now. I don't know if you could see me exiting, uh, but all students of the Rachel Bennett School of Belly Dance know that we never walk with strut. So I just, just did some very good strutting, holding my veil and walking. You do that anyway, Rachel. You do I'm, that when you're like, you know, walking I do down it the in waitrose <laughs> because I'm posh. <laughs> So that was a great set, that was really good fun. Um, so what we, do we do now? Let's, let's what say do we do what now? usually happens. Well, when we finished, I normally like to mop my brow. <laughs> There's a little old flannel that I keep in my suitcase. There's a top tip for you girls. Flannels, 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 bring <laughs> yes. a flannel. Mop your, Not mop your baby brows. wipes because it just oh, smears no. everything around. You need a really good clean flannel. Really good clean flannel. Especially if you've done a, an energetic <laughs> piece. <laughs> So yeah, so we uh, go and what do we do? We go and get changed and then we come down. And if the chefs are feeling nice, let me see if I can see the chefs nice? here. We don't know. You Does can, he look nice tonight? Wave. Hi. There's our lovely <laughs> chef. Oh. They're very good to us. Shall I go and show a little yeah, bit, yeah, chef? Oh, the door stuck. Okay, let's see if we can see the food. Chefs! Hello! 